This part contains question. This part contains question number 13, 14, 15, and 16 of exercise 9.1. As observed from the top of a 75 meter high lighthouse from the sea level, the angles of depression of two ships are 30 and 45 degree. If one ship is exactly behind the other on the same side of the lighthouse, find the distance between the two ships. So here is a lighthouse and the observation is on the first ship and the second. The angle of depression to the first is 30 and the second is 45 degree. Let's name this A, B, C and D. So here this angle would be 45 and the second is 30. So the given is theta 1 30 degree, theta 2 45 degree, AB is 75 meter. Find the distance between the two ships, Malab C means C and D, CD. Let's take the first triangle ABC tan theta 2 is equal to AB upon BC. So tan 45 equal to AB that is 75 upon BC. So tan 45 is 1 which is equal to 75 upon BC. So BC is equal to 75 meter. Let's say CD is X. Therefore for the second triangle A D D tan theta 1 equal to A B upon B D. So tan theta 1 is 30, A B is 75 upon B D is 75 plus x. Tan 30 means 1 by root 3, which is equal to 75 by 75 plus x means 75 plus x equal to 75 into root 3. Root 3 will be multiplied with 75. So x equal to 75 root 3 minus 75 plus 75 will go on right hand side. So x equal to 75 common root 3 minus 1 meter. And this is nothing but CD 75 into root 3 minus 1 meter. The distance between two ships, a 1.2 meter tall girl. So here is a girl, 1.2 meter tall, spots a balloon moving with the wind in a horizontal line at a height of 88.2 meter. So let's say here is a balloon. The height is 88.2 meter. The angle of elevation of the balloon from the eyes of the girl at any instant is 60 degree. This angle is 60 degree. After some time, the angle of elevation reduces to 30. It means the balloon reached somewhere here where the angle is reduced to 30 degree. Find the distance traveled by the balloon during the interval. This distance we have to find. Let's name it as A, B, C, D, E, F, G and H. Given is the height of the girl that is AB 1.2 meter theta 1 60 degree, theta 2 is 30 degree and the height of the balloon that is CE which is 88.2 meter. Find the distance traveled that is EF. When the height, now when the height of the girl that is AB is 1.2 meter, it means DE is also 1.2 meter. So the remaining that is CD, CD will be 88.2 minus 1.2 
which is equal to 87 meter that is CD so we can say from C to D is 87 therefore H to G is also 87 now CD is equal to HG therefore HG is equal to 87 meter let's take the first triangle CAD so tan theta 1 is equal to CD upon AD tan 60 is equal to CD 87 upon AD root 3 is equal to 87 upon AD so AD is equal to 87 upon root 3 meter let's say DG is X meter DG is equal to X meter so now we'll take the next triangle H A G tan theta 2 is equal to H G upon A G so tan theta 2 is 30 degree H G is 87 A G tan 30 is 1 upon root 3 equal to 87 upon A G so A G is equal to 87 root 3 meter now A G is equal to B F so B F is equal to B E plus E F B F is equal to 87 root 3 is equal to B E 87 upon root 3 as B E is equal to A D B E and A D are same plus E F E F is equal to 87 root 3 minus 87 upon root 3 which is equal to 87 root 3 minus 1 upon root 3 which is equal to 87 root 3 into root 3 minus 1 upon root 3 which is equal to 87 root 3 into root 3 is 3 minus 1 upon root 3 which is equal to 87 2 upon root 3 which is equal to 87 into 2 upon root 3 we can multiply and divide by root 3 and we get 87 into 2 into root 3 upon 3 so which is equal to 29 into 2 into root 3 equal to 58 root 3 meter so the distance traveled by the balloon from e to f is 58 root 3 meter a straight highway leads to the foot of the tower means here is a highway and a tower a man standing at the top of the tower observes a car at an angle of depression of 30 degree so here is a car and a man is observing from top of the tower the angle of depression is 30 degree which is approaching the foot of the tower with a uniform speed six seconds later the angle of depression of the car is found to be 60 degree so after six seconds the car reaches somewhere here and the angle of depression also increases 60 degree find the time taken by the car to reach the foot of the tower from this point let's name as a b c and d the given is theta 1 30 degree theta 2 60 degree and the time that it takes to travel from point d to c is 6 second and we have to find the time taken by the car to reach from point c to b let's take the first triangle with 30 degree angle that is triangle a b d so tan theta 1 equal to a b upon b d so what is tan theta 1 it is tan 30 degree equal to a b upon b d tan 30 is 1 by root 3 which is equal to a b upon 
dd so ab is equal to bd upon root 3 next is a triangle abc tan theta 2 is equal to ab upon bc tan 60 equal to ab upon bc and tan 60 is root 3 which is equal to ab upon bc so ab is equal to bc root 3 now let's equate this to we get bd upon root 3 is equal to bc into root 3 therefore bd is equal to bc into root 3 into root 3 so bd is equal to 3 bc so bd is equal to dc plus bc now bd is 3 times bc is equal to dc plus bc 3 bc minus bc is equal to dc so 2 bc is equal to dc it means bc is equal to dc by 2 so if dc needs 6 seconds then the car will need 6 divided by 2 3 seconds to reach from point c to b that is bc angle of elevation of the top of the tower from two points at a distance of four meter and nine meter from the base of the tower is and in the same straight line with it are complementary now complementary means two angles sum of two angles is equal to 90 degree the angle of elevation of the top of the tower so here is a tower from two points at a distance of 4 meter and 9 meter. So the first point is at 4 meter. And the second is at 9 meter. So let's say this angle is theta. Then the second will be 90 minus theta. Because the total is 90. Let's name it as A b c and d given is b c which is 4 meter and b d which is 9 meter theta 1 is theta and theta 2 is 90 minus theta and we have to find the height of the tower that is a b is 6 meter that we have to prove so let's take the first triangle a b c tan theta 2 equal to a b upon b c so tan 90 minus theta equal to a b upon 4 tan 90 minus theta is cot theta which is equal to a b upon 4 let's take the next triangle a b d so tan theta 1 equal to a b upon b d and tan theta 1 is theta which is equal to a b upon 9 now tan theta into cot theta is equal to a b upon 9 into a b upon 4 tan theta and cot theta will be multiplied then a b upon 4 and a b upon 9 will be multiplied so tan theta 1 into cot theta 1 is equal to 1. So ab upon 9 into ab upon 4. 1 equal to ab square upon 36. So 1 into 36. 36 equal to ab square. So ab is equal to root of 36. So ab is equal to 6 meter root.